What's up, Sailor Guardians? My name is Sailor Snubs. This is Jen. Hi, Jen. Hi. <laughs> Jen is here with me today because we are going to be taste testing the ocean bombs that have come out in collaboration with Sailor Moon over the past couple of years. Now, I do realize that there have been some new art that is slowly coming out from Ocean Bomb as well. And I think that those ones are actually the same flavor per character. In front of us right now, we have 10 different flavors and all of these are in blind cups labeled number one through number 10, and we're going to go through them and try to figure out which character and which flavor each one is. Now we are allowed to cheat. So if we want to, we can pick mm -hmm. up the cans and look at the character and look at the flavor of them as well, which I think is a good thing because I also want to describe the flavors to you. I will say I'm not a big fan of sparkling water. Are you? I drink it every day of my life. Oh my God. Every day. How? Yes. It's like, it's delicious. It's, it's spicy water. It's like ew. spiky. It's so delicious. But it's refreshing. missing. No. <laughs> it's missing the sugar. It's <laughs> missing the 48 grams of sugar that you get in a Coca-Cola. Yes. It's like, it's like they forgot the syrup. <laughs> mm -mm. Love sparkling water. Ew. Okay. So you'll probably, well, I don't know. These, supposedly these are pretty sugary. Yeah. Do they really have sugar in them? Yeah, they have a lot of sugar in them. Oh my god, that's so much. I know. <laughs> oh my god. It's, it's a lot of, Dang. yeah, there's like 23 grams of sugar okay. in these, so. Well, then these might be just what you needed then. I know. Yeah. I'm going to be so hyper after yeah. this. So before we get started, this is Jen. She's She's been in this room many times off camera, but she's never joined me on camera. Although you have seen her in some of my pictures from my last trip to Japan. Yes. But we've actually known each other for a long time. Yes, you moved across the street from me when we were in eighth grade. Yes. Yes. Eighth freaking grade. Yes. And then we met, came over and met you, started talking about Pokemon, <laughs> and then said, hey, do you want to come over and hang out? The rest is history. Yay. I was such a big nerd with my giant glasses and my curly <laughs> hair. And I was just like, so um, do you like Pokemon? Do you like Pokemon? <laughs> and she's like, yes. And I was like, um, <laughs> do you like Sailor Moon? Yeah, she's like, yes. <laughs> and it was through her that I discovered that Sailor Moon went on farther than the first couple of seasons. <laughs> like you introduced me to this whole world of Sailor Moon that I didn't know existed in my like little underground mind in Missouri. That's so funny. And now here we are, much older. <laughs> yes, much older. <laughs> We're much wiser. We're a lot older now. <laughs> yes. And uh, you're now you're I'm <laughs> Now, apparently I never grew up. So now yeah. I bought all the toys that we couldn't afford when we were yes. children. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started with testing. We'll just start with number one, go all the way down to number 10. We can do like a wine tasting and mm -hmm. talk about the flavor a little bit. And then we both have our own list here. Our husbands have poured the drinks for us and they have a list over here that we're not allowed to look at. It's a folded piece of paper, so I don't even know what's on it. We'll check that at the end and see who, oh, we should choose. What What does the winner get? Oh, okay. So we are going to the Sailor Moon Museum in Osaka. I'm so excited. In April. I can't I wait to wait. take you. She's never been. Be amazing. <laughs> I'm going to cry many tears. So will I. But we're basically <laughs> going to be buying each other a gift from the gift shop. Whoever the winner is. I love us. it. So, okay, cool. I yeah. promise I won't choose the giant LED that costs like $4,000. <laughs> so we're not that bougie. <laughs> oh my God, no. I'll choose like a keychain or something. Yes, like, keychain would be delightful. Yes. I'll do the same for you. Yes. If you win the blind taste testing, then I'll buy you something from the Sailor Moon Museum. I can't wait. You'll get to see the winner here and then we'll come back in April when we go to the museum and you'll get to see us purchase the winner's <laughs> item from the Sailor Moon uh, Museum. I almost so said fun. store. We're going there too. We're going there too. Yes. And we're gonna see the manholes. Yes, the manholes. <laughs> the manhole, the covers. manhole covers. <laughs> There's a thing. <laughs> okay, let's get started with right. number one. Okay. <laughs> Tastes like sparkling water. There's not much flavor to it. There's not. It's almost like citrusy, I would say. I do get citrus from this one. You get citrus sure. too? Okay, sure. so let's see. I'm gonna look at the flavors. We have watermelon, we have kiwi, mm, pineapple. I don't think it's pineapple. Grapefruit, lychee. Lychee. What the heck is a lychee? It's a little tropical fruit. It's like a little spiky ball. Oh, I've seen those. Yeah. Okay, mango, cucumber. Cucumber sounds nice. Mm. 
strawberry, pear, okay, and oh, pomelo So flavored. we have multiple citrus to choose from. <gasps> Wait, which one of these are citrus? The pomelo is- That's citrus? Citrus as well, it's a giant okay. like, grapefruit kind of citrus. If these boys did like number one for moon and then went through number 10 being Pluto, I'm gonna be very mad. I don't think they did that. I hope I not. think that this <laughs> They is... don't know which character is which, so. No, I think that this is Sailor Saturn. <laughs> this, that's my guess for now. Saturn, she's grapefruit? Mm -hmm. mm, okay. I don't know, I'm kind of getting berries now too. Mm. This is hard. Yeah, this is hard. Okay, this is gonna be a lot harder than I <laughs> thought it would be. I'm gonna go with, I can taste a little bit of grapefruit. Mm -hmm. I wonder if all of them are really light like this. Yeah. We haven't tried any of them before. So this very is uh, this is very curious. Yes, I agree. I don't taste mango. I don't know what lychee tastes like though. Yeah, it's just kind of like a sweet little spiky ball. <laughs> yes, it's tropical oh, fruit. Oh, it's a spiky ball. Duh, That's what hello. it tastes like. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna put down for mine. I'm gonna say that it's Chibi Moon, which is lychee. Mm -hmm. So my number one is gonna be lychee. Okay, what's what's yours? So I'll say grapefruit and so there's like, I feel like it's grapefruit. <laughs> it might be grapefruit. <laughs> I don't know, it really could be many of these items. It, it really so. could, oh my gosh, <laughs> this is gonna be so hard. All right, All so right. let's put number one over here yes, okay. and I'll keep them in order. Perfect. Let's do number two. All right. Okay. Now the thing about all of these is there's no color to these. There's no coloring no, whatsoever. Totally clear. Yeah, they're totally clear. So it's it's impossible to tell which one is which without tasting it. Even the smell, like the smell is so light. Oh, whoa, that one is That was sweet. stronger, yeah. That one's very sweet. It's much mm. stronger. Almost like mm, pineapple maybe or kiwi. I was thinking kiwi. Yeah. I think. Maybe watermelon too. We can always go back and revisit if we taste one and they're super similar, we can oh, always go that's back. That's a good call. We could like notate it. On yeah. There. So don't drink all yours. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna say kiwi for mine. That's Neptune. Is that what lychee tastes like? I don't know what lychee tastes like. <laughs> I've never actually had one. Okay. All right, number two three. Down. Number three. Oh lord, this is gonna make me burn. <laughs> Hold on. <clears throat> there you go. I knew it was coming. <laughs> Tasted like a burger. Not this. <laughs> This is another kind of like faintly tasted one, I think. What is that? What the hell is that? What is that? I don't know. Cucumber? Oh, I don't want to get my hair in there. No, don't do that. Pear? Maybe it's pear? Mm, cucumber? Mm. <laughs> this is hard. I'm going to say cucumber. I don't know, man. That's a tough one. That's very not distinct at all. <laughs> yeah, it's not. That's, ooh. That one's very I'm hard. Guessing. You're gonna say kiwi? Yeah. Okay. Kiwi's... Okay, we're on number four. number four. This one is clear colored. It has a smell. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, hold on. We gotta do it the wine way. Oh, I used yeah. to live in the Bay Area where we would do wine tastings like this. Aerate the sparkling you water. You have to aerate the mm. sparkling water. Long, deep sniff. <laughs> I don't know. It smells kind of like my dog's water. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it smells like her water. It's, it's a really odd flavor as well. It's very odd. It one. smells like my dog's water bowl. Doesn't taste like. Ew! What is that? I don't like that one. Uh, yeah, but I don't care for this one. <laughs> no, I don't like it. What is it? <laughs> That's disgusting. That is not good. I don't like number that is four. Not good. It's so gross. No. Yeah, I was thinking pear too. I don't like pears. I like pears, but they're only good like two weeks out of the year, man. <laughs> that's the time they Maybe that's why they need to announce and oh. release the Mercury pear one when it's in season. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Because I'm sure it's all natural. natural. Yes. Yeah, they're yeah, totally natural. <laughs> they're, they're squeezing the pears out themselves. Yeah. So, Sorry, Mercury. So if that is pear, I feel so bad for Mercury. You know, she's extremely popular in Japan. That's so interesting. Yeah, she's, she's, she's not over she's here. She's like yeah. one of the most popular Sailor Scouts in Japan. I think it's because everybody is very studious over there. Although, mm. like, I'm not Japanese. I don't know mm. everything about the culture, but it's still interesting to think about. <laughs> okay, we're on number five. Number five. Ooh, I recognize this. What is that? Watermelon? Pine? Mango. Mango? Mm. It is it is a fruit that I recognize. I think this is the most like actually distinctly fruit flavored one we've tasted yet. Yes, it's very distinct. And I think it's strawberry. I think it's, you think it's strawberry? Mm -hmm. Oh man. <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna lose. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's, I'm gonna say pineapple. 
Oh, you might be right. Which one's pineapple? Pineapple is Uranus? That's weird. What an interesting flavor for, for Uranus. I don't know, her hair is yellow. <laughs> they chose mangoes pineapple. mangoes are yellow too. That's true. Yeah. I tried to color coordinate. Wait, is mango Venus? Yeah, yes. that, makes, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna say pineapple for her. I think you're right. Or for that one. Mm -hmm. All right, we're on number six. Oh my God. Coursing through my veins. <laughs> yeah, you never eat sugar. Mm -hmm. I'm over here eating like, I got Starbucks in the morning. <laughs> I got Skittles that I'm eating before we're recording. Like, I just, and I'm like, I live off that stuff. I have a tall iced Americano black. <laughs> <laughs> give me sugar, give me nothing. This one is oh. extremely sugary. Wow, yes it is. Oh my mm. God. Whoa, that tastes like they put like two pounds of sugar in there. Mm -hmm. That's almost too much sugar for me. Mm -hmm. That's that a intense. lot. That's very, Ooh. very sweet. Number six is very sweet. Ooh, yeah, that is, mm. that is sweet. Good Lord. <laughs> very sweet. Mm. Of, of anything with this one, it's extremely sweet. It doesn't really have like a pungent fruit yeah, flavor. Yeah, it's like the sugar totally takes over. Maybe strawberry? Strawberry is such a mm. sweet fruit. That would be my be best guess. I'm gonna say strawberry. Okay, number six. So that would be Mars. Ooh, maybe, <gasps> maybe it's watermelon. I don't know, it's like they're morphing in my mouth now. It's like, <laughs> they're all just... Should we get like a glass of water? <laughs> We need like a palate cleanser or a something. A palate cleanser, <laughs> yes. We need like a charcuterie board, uh -huh. a palate cleanser. <laughs> Some crackers on the side. Okay, number All seven. Right. We're on number seven. <laughs> I'm feeling so hyper now. <laughs> yeah, my, my heart this is This is so much sugar, oh my God. That one tastes like soap. Um. <laughs> no, Yeah. I don't like it. No. It's not good. But I know what it is. You do? I'm gonna cheat off of you. I think because it does have that it's soapy cucumber. flavor. It's cucumber. Yeah, this one's cucumber. Oh, mm -hmm. crap. I got number three wrong for sure. This one's cucumber. That's so gross. I usually like cucumbers, but there's so many like cucumber soaps that sometimes the flavor is just like not quite right in there. Yep, nope. Okay. That's uh, That tastes like a cucumber soap. If you wanna like tell a kid to wash their mouth out with soap, just give them, give them, give give them, them the, Jupiter's. The Jupiter's soap. <laughs> Water. Jupiter's water. Wait, so that means that number three. Okay, I'm gonna have to come back. You gotta back go and back and, and re guess. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, now we're getting down to the last three. Number eight. Number eight. Number eight. This one is refreshing. That one tastes mm. like soap. Mm -hmm. This one does taste like cucumber. Mm -hmm. This one tastes a lot more like cucumber. This one tastes like, this one I mean, you have the carbonation, cucumber. of course, but if you put cucumbers in water, this is what it mm -hmm. tastes like. So, yeah, I think number eight think is cucumbers. Occasion. Crap! <laughs> now I don't know. I know. Just oh gotta no! Go back, gotta go back and retry and see if we can Jen. get any more right. Okay, number nine. We still don't have pomelo. I think neither of us has uh, number one. Pomelo or mango. <clears throat> Those are the two that are, they have not made any appearance on this list so far. I haven't listed watermelon <clears throat> yet, so I think I need to figure out which one is watermelon. Oh, this is so hard. Watermelon. Yes. Yeah. Number nine, I think, is watermelon. It's got that watermelon sweetness. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like that one. Number nine is good. Yeah, that one's pretty good. Yeah. For somebody that does not like sparkling water, I like number nine. And number 10. Okay. Oh. Last one, but we are gonna go back and revisit a couple of these. This one's not very strong at all, and it's not very sweet. Maybe pomelo? I don't know what pomelo tastes like. Sailor Moon. Wait, that's hers, right? Mm -hmm. Moon is pomelo. Yeah, I have no idea what pomelo is. Okay, so I need to go back and revisit number three and number seven. And I need to figure out if one of these is, did I have a grapefruit on here yet? You have <clears throat> no grapefruit. No, okay, so maybe grapefruit or mango. Grapefruit or mango, okay. That one doesn't taste like either grapefruit or mango. Oh man, I'm way off. <laughs> I know, my taste buds are <laughs> oh, no. confused now. Oh man, I don't know which one this is. Number three, what are you? It's definitely not cucumber though. Now that I tasted number eight. I know, I need to, I think number seven is not. I just had a grapefruit. They're, they're not super sugary. Grapefruits are kind of sour sometimes. Mm -hmm. So maybe that's grapefruit. Okay, I'm gonna put grapefruit, so that would be Saturn for number three. Number seven was the soap one, right? I'm totally lost on number seven. I don't want to drink it. I know, it's not good. 
But we know that number eight is cucumber. It's so gross. It's so nasty. Okay, I'm gonna just say number seven is mango. Sorry, I Venus. I, I am know. so sorry, girl. But I gotta put down a number there somewhere. Yeah, let's say that one's mango. Tastes like man. Tastes like man. <laughs> what is number six? Because we know that number oh, nine is watermelon. So yeah. Number six. That was a really we sweet one. It was strawberry. Yes. It does have that berry flavor. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> this is hard. Oh, no. oh, pineapple. Oh, yeah. Right, we're becoming pineapple for... You are becoming a pineapple. Oh, yes. Which one was it? Oh, this one. Okay. There's our list. All right. We finished. We finished. Yay. Now we get to look at the cheat sheet. I'm uh, I'm concerned. I have I have <laughs> concerns as well. I have concerns. <laughs> I have a feeling that neither of us are gonna do very well on this no. Uh, quiz. No. I haven't been in school in a very long time, <laughs> and um, I'm a, I'm a bad test taker. I used to cheat off of her <laughs> when we were in school. I'm sorry, teachers. If any of my teachers are watching. It's fine. We're it, almost I 40. Was, I think it was junior year chemistry. Class. We've survived just fine. Yeah. Oh yeah, I hated chemistry. Yeah. I was so bad. Yeah. yeah, I was always on her team so that I could just cheat off the time. <laughs> I was always more of the artistic like theater girl. Mm -hmm. I was good at math though. You were good at math. Yeah, I was mm -hmm. always good, good at math, but that mm -hmm. was it. <laughs> that was it. Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. We're gonna read. Number one is grapefruit. Okay, so I got that one. <gasps> Jen got grapefruit right mm. on number one. I got that incorrect. I put lychee. Number two is strawberry. Two is strawberry? Shut up! Get out of here. No! It is sweet, actually. Yeah, I can see that. Damn, I guess. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> okay, so we both we missed both number two. We both got that one wrong. Okay, Real wrong. Miss number two. Oh man. Okay, number three is mango. So and you guessed grapefruit. I put and I grapefruit. Kiwi. And you put both kiwi. Wrong. We both got it wrong. Okay. Number three, both wrong. Okay. Oh my god, we did so bad. No, I know. Number we did. four is lychee. I, what did we put? We both guessed pear. We for, both guessed pear. Okay. okay. Number five is pineapple. Okay, you got that one right, but Woo! I guessed strawberry, which is very, very wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so wrong. So what have we gotten so far? One I each? I think we've gotten one each. Oh so god, far. that's so bad. <laughs> All right, number six is pear. Six is pear, which I guessed pineapple. Oh, we, we both got them wrong. Oh no. Okay, okay. Number, seven. number seven is kiwi. Oh god. Did we both get them wrong? Mango, and then I marked Did it you not out. put anything? No. What were you gonna put? I don't no. You already I, had kiwi up there, so. Yeah, I was just probably gonna guess whatever was up there. Pomelo? Just pomelo, yeah. Okay. This is wrong. So that's wrong. You wrong as hell. Wrong. Okay. Number, <laughs> Number eight. eight. Cucumber. Cucumber. Cucumber, clearly correct. Hey, we both got it right. Yay, okay. Number nine, nine is, watermelon. is watermelon. We both, both got, got it right. That one hey. right. <laughs> we found our stride at the very end. <clears throat> yeah, right. Number and 10 is pomelo. You got pomelo right. Hey. Are we tied? I got four. You win! <gasps> By one By point! One. Four to three! Four to three! Ding, 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 ding! Woo! What are your thoughts on these? I'm... Yeah. There's a few of them that I really liked. Mm -hmm. I really like number nine, which is Sailor Pluto Watermelon. Mm -hmm. I thought this one tasted really good. It's very sweet, but it also has that nice watermelon flavor. If you like sweetness, then yes, I would say you would like Sailor Pluto's. I would say if I you're not into you? sweetness. Yeah, if you're not into sweetness. Then I would suggest number eight. Here, number eight. Yeah. So That's once funny. once we found the true cucumber <laughs> Sailor Jupiter drink, uh, I was impressed. I liked it. I, yes. I, it did taste like putting cucumber in water, mm -hmm. like a nice, summer beverage like a sparkling water beverage so I, I would keep that one i would use i would actually drink it which one was your favorite was it jupiter definitely the cucumber okay because it was the least sweet for yeah me. and the so. most sweet of course was my favorite yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're like opposites yeah. <laughs> yeah not super impressed with these there's definitely like big differences in terms of the like fruit like the amount the hardiness of the fruit that you get from these 
and how much of a sugar flavor versus how much of like a nice natural flavor that you get from them. So I'm glad that we got to do this taste testing and I think that it was really unbiased and very fair, mm -hmm. which was good because each of us have favorite Sailor Guardians. Which one's yours? Where is she? There, there she, she is. is. There she is. Sailor Saturn. We have her necklace on today <gasps> I for love this it. purpose. Yes, we love her. I have like four <laughs> favorites, so. <laughs> I have all the favorites. Yes. Actually, Pluto is one of my favorites, as well as Saturn, love her, and then Mars and Moon. Mm -hmm. Those are my yeah. favorite inners. Oh my God, I have to burp. Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> all this carbonation. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Uh, let me know if you have tried any of the ocean bombs. I would love to know what your favorites are and if you have any kind of perceptions or opinions about these. If there's other ocean bombs that they that the company has made that you think that I would like or that Jen would like, let us know down in the comments as well. And don't forget to subscribe. If you like videos like this, if you wanna see Jen come in here again, you never know. Maybe I'll invite her back. I'll have to like drag her ass in here. Get on my video. Bye everybody. Thank you for watching. Bye. Johnny.